Nick Cannon has always claimed to be a great partner and father but his ex, Jessica White, doesn't agree with his self-confident assessment. Welcome back it's your host Nancy Brown. If you are new here make sure you have subscribed to our YouTube channel. White admitted to Safari Samuels on the most recent episode of Love & Hip Hop, Atlanta that she was just getting out of an eight-year relationship, in reference to her time spent with the Wild N Out star. In addition, she acknowledged that the union was polyamorous. I was in an eight-year relationship, polyamorous. But it was not fair. I wasn't allowed to have other partners but he was, she claimed to Samuels, who was a friend of Cannon's but who had no idea that his boy was dating the 39-year-old model. White has previously been open about her relationship with Cannon who she dated intermittently from 2010 until 2020. She posted a lengthy message on her Instagram stories last month, shortly after attending the blue carpet premiere of French Montana's new documentary, For Cottage, at the Tribeca Festival, which many people assumed was directed at Canon. I wanted it to work, prayed every day that you'd see me and love me the way that I loved you. Maybe you did but just kept it from me during the relationship. I walked away with more questions than anything. I don't know till this day really why current things had to happen, she wrote in part. In a 2021 interview with Hollywood Unlocked, White stated that she had a miscarriage in 2020 after getting pregnant with Nick Cannon's child, and that she had learned of another woman's pregnancy by Cannon via television in 2021. I probably regret that I should have saved it for the fucking book, and got paid for it, she told the outlet. When asked how long the chapter on Cannon would be, White added it would be very short I think if you put it in a book, he would be half a chapter. A half a chapter is still too long. She continued, I went through an emotionally abusive relationship, and everybody goes through it. I am just the first person in Hollywood to talk about it, and not try to make a pretty picture of it. I don't want to be perfect. That's it for today, thanks for watching. Tell us what you think in the comment section and most importantly subscribe. See you.